For fuck's sake. <laughs> I fucking hate this mic arm. That shit. There we go. Da, Welcome da, da. to the Dest. Wait, no, wrong one. Da, to the Jar Blab. The Destiny Blab. Where we are going to talk about Destiny or something. Yeah. So, um. I suppose what's happening at the moment is the update. Which wait, I'll do wait, my so. I'll do my best to run over that from what I know, but I might fuck it up a wait, little so bit. Wait, so Destiny has had nothing since the Taken King? Correct. Apart from, apart like from a, a couple of minor events, updates, like Sparrow Racing League, and that, but it's nothing though, effective. Thing. It's yeah, nothing yeah. in the same vein. And, and there's a Halloween thing, but they've been bigging up this April update as like the the next big thing, and it's all free mm-hmm. because whatever. And then when they detailed it, I was like, "Ha, huh, man, I'm never going to play this game again." <laughs> yeah. So for those of you that don't know about the April update, well, they're just doing that standard thing where they add a bit of story content. Uh, upgrade the light level. They've they've made a couple like some improvements. I yeah. like yeah okay, but stuff that should have done, done months ago. Yeah, yeah. But I suppose it's like they th- they figure like we may as well save it for a big update. I yeah. suppose that's the logic. But at the same time, it's like there's lots of little ones to be nice. Yeah. Honestly, so you've been dabbling back into the game. Yeah, I play a bit with, here and there. I play with um, shout out to Danny and Gecko. I play yeah. with Danny and Gecko. Whereas like that's that's one part of the audience, yeah. but I'm the part of the audience where I'm just like. I said in my second Destiny video, if they don't like really make some changes mm-hmm. and show that they actually are going to do stuff like, with this, then I'm out. And I have been yeah, out. I mean, since I play then. the game because I I play it with them. I like. Yeah. I, have, I have different games. I play with different people. I like to mm-hmm. play it because I play with them. I like to play yeah. with them. But like <laughs> the game itself, though, is just offering nothing. Mm-hmm. It's so yeah. I was so like, the Iron Banner was on is on currently. And I was, but like I, the Iron Banner is like, is is the same as it was yeah. when the game launched. Yeah, and. Everything yeah. is the same as when the game launched. I think we need to play stay on top. I suppose we should probably talk about the update more than we should just fucking rag on shit that we've ragged. No, before. like what I'm saying is like what what happened to this ten year plan? There, right. there is no, there was no, there is no focus from from them in terms of like. Well, originally it was the plan was game expansion, game expansion, yeah. game expansion, like big expansion, obviously yeah. little shit released mm-hmm. in between. That was their plan. But then at the last second they that went out the window. Actually, but then the pl- but then. <laughs> Behind the scenes, the game was made in one year, technically, mm-hmm. because everything was fucked at yep. Bungie, mm-hmm. and then the content was gradually being dribbled out that was completed as yeah. the expansions, as a way to get Just, a yeah. ton of money. Yeah, And now they've abandoned that in favor for microtransactions and that sort of thing. Yeah, which is something they have added and um, that people I talk to have expressed concerns over. Namely, yeah. namely Gecko. When when it was like, first introduced, I was like, "Dude, well, this is this is the beginning." But that was because, yeah. Then, then it felt as like, okay, this is just emo shit, whatever. Yeah. But now it's like they've added this new currency, like sterling chests or some yeah. shit. You get access. Is that sterling, in the game right now? No. Where that is coming in this April? Or something. Or something. We have three chances a week to get these from completing three activities. You will get a sterling chest Thing, or whatever yeah. from from each one. So that's like three chances to get some of the new the new stuff. Yeah. The legendary the new stuff that is actually the same stuff yeah just like you have a new light level and you like look at paint on yeah. it literally it's like added this they added this thing called chroma so it's yeah. just like highlights like light highlights so you can look all yeah. tronny if you want but with that you can also pay money to get this new gear like and i think it drops at like level three defense or something so like you have to so you have infuse to do it of up to the infusing thing. and that's the thing they change infusion so that it just it doesn't do like a like an amount of it it just just does it to that level which yeah. is what it should have been anyway. I figure what is happening behind the scenes is they have a very small team still mm-hmm. working on Destiny 1 and the rest of the studio is just like they've yeah. got their heads down on the sequel, mm-hmm. whatever that is and when that's going to come out. Hence why Destiny 1 is like so dry Yeah, and there's just nothing. But I'd sing with that and they just let the game like... Yeah, it just seems weird though because like... I think, I think with Destiny 2 now though, they are more prepared for like to keep you would hope content so. coming out. You would hope so. Whereas but then like, how long have they what, had? They just have to take the hit, don't they? They have to take the player loss. Yeah. They have to. I think they'll come back. Yeah. Loads mm-hmm. of them will come back for Destiny 2. They've got that Activision um, advertising money mm-hmm. behind them when the new one comes out. Yeah. Uh, and they've got from the creators of Halo and Call, Co- and Call of Duty, which always sells. Yeah. It's just For someone like me, though, 
if Destiny 2 is just the same, it's just like four new planets. Oh, God, yeah, I wouldn't. A I, two hour well, long like, story. No, I say I wouldn't. We'd fucking have to. We have to to make a video. <laughs> Every I time would, now. I would play the minimum if it was bad. Mm hmm. And just completely fucking annihilate it in a video and just be like, just I don't, I don't ever want that to happen. I always no, want games to no, be good. No, 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 no. Yeah, it's just like I would love to see because, like, with the Taken I, King, they were it was a step in the right direction. I'll you say know? it like we we just came from the Final Fantasy video. Yeah, that we'll probably release before this. Yeah. So I guess for everyone else, they might have just come from the Final Fantasy yeah. video. If you have, yeah, cheers. Um, I have more faith in Bungie than I do. Fucking whatever Square Enix are fucking around with. Yeah, <laughs> Bun more Bungie knows there. how to make a game. Mm -hmm. And they know the how to make is... it look really, really good yeah. at the same time. But like, when would have production really started for two? They would have had a team just working on it as well, the first one yeah. released. They would have been out. They would have gradually it. dribbled into mm -hmm. the other one. But then, who made the Taken King? That was quite a lot they of shit. Had the team split fifty-fifty. Yeah, and now they mo the majority you would it's imagine are on the next one. Yeah, yeah, but then. That's not maybe that much well, time. Like, I kind of hope like they incorporate all their ideas they had for Destiny One, what it was gonna be, the story, things like that. Now they have they've established what the gameplay is and how, yeah. how armor works, which they can still tweak that. They're still uh -huh. they're allowed to. Players will let them. Yeah. As long as they can still shoot things and have cool armor or whatever. Yeah. They but, do have a foundation now to yeah. build off is the only yeah. thing. Yeah, that's the main that's thing. the one thing I can okay of. If they incorporate some of their old ideas from Destiny One though, which look pretty sound and pretty yeah. good. Destiny 2 will be a much better game. Yeah. They they just need more more content. Mm -hmm. It's the bottom line. Like, it should be and so the, diverse. What they did with Destiny 1, the problem they have had is that as they've released new content, they've killed old content. Yeah. And just made it completely fucking pointless. Yeah. Like, I suppose we had... And their reasoning is always because there's like a gun that's too overpowered. Yeah. Well, like, just, I, I guess just tweak it then. With Destiny, before the Taken King came out, all the raids were viable. Because mm -hmm. you could etheric light shit up to yeah. So like, I could still do the first raid. If I wanted a Fate yeah. Bringer, I could do it. I'd get Fate Bringer. But now, like, that, that raid is pointless. Yeah, for, a, for pointless. a game that's light on content mm -hmm. already, making it redundant I, I, with each I thing is weird. I thought this update was going to be... By the way, guys, everything has like got, got a purpose now. Fuck it. Here you go. It seems bizarre that you wouldn't do that because then they've, they it reinvigorates haven't. everything then. Because mm -hmm. the there'll be people who have jumped on who like yeah. have never played the first raid because there's no point. Another weird thing is Destiny 2. Like, the problem is we're, we're, they've got the thing of our solar system. Yeah. The old shit will have to be in the game still or accessible in some so? capacity. I was thinking about that. Do you think they're going to have all the stuff from the first game? I think they it? will leave it in. Because like... The, the the first game was out on the mm -hmm. previous gen, wasn't I they it? Could do that. They could update the textures and just make it run because it's because I'm I'm hoping you you want it to obviously abandon previous gen yeah. with this next oh, one. Oh yeah, definitely. They but um, will. and they need, with that they need to increase like loading time. Well, you know, well, it needs decrease to be 60 frames. Frames, needs to be sixty frames. Needs to be sixty frames about it. Um, because the game looks really good. Yeah. Just and imagine it with frames are a bit weird. Sometimes yeah. it's a bit jarring coming from like Halo Five yeah. to that. Yeah. Well, because like. It, ha it did have to be on the previous gen. Yeah. It was to held make back it run. Massively by that. Yeah. And all the like architecture is like weirdly combined with the 360 one. Yeah. Like they couldn't upgrade vault space because of 360. Yeah. Because they're they've so managed to add another. They've managed to work it out again and add another like really? space for all of them. See, it just seems. Yeah. It seems weird update. that they just haven't abandoned it and just been like, sorry, you can carry your character over, which but I we think just you can cannot do. support this anymore. Yeah. I suppose like, they surely, figured, if they did that, can you imagine some of like the bullshit backlash, like yeah. some of the internet, like nice the, news providers. The less than one percent of people who yeah. play on 360 and yeah. PS3 will be like, people what? are not playing Destiny on 360 and PS3, really. And if they are, it's like so minimal. Mm -hmm. It'd be like, look at like imagine looking at the graphs and the Bungie Studios. And they, but they know that and that's enough to like make people be assholes yeah. about mm -hmm. it. So, so they're just like, well, we just fuck. And they're already on like shaky ground yeah. with the community as it is. Because yeah. when you, I follow Bungie on Twitter, you just look at the replies and yeah. it's just people like, wow, you suck. Mm -hmm. Where's the new content? You know, stuff like that. Yeah. I understand. It's, yeah, it's two weeks from now. It's two weeks, is it? I to this update. I think so, yeah. It's, well, they're calling it, it's the April update. I know it's that. Yeah. So I think it's like, two weeks from now or well, two weeks from Tuesday. It's just. Everything after the initial launch is just too little, too late. Mm -hmm. Every single time, every single time. Yeah, and they've just—I guess it's all just riding on this unannounced sequel <laughs> that we have no idea when it's coming out. I remember out. coming home because I was still in—I was still in sixth form. Yeah, when uh, Crota's End came out, or mm -hmm. Dark Below, coming home and playing it and just being like, "Are you serious?" 
Like you'd been playing a bit that day. Yeah. And me and Jim got back and we we're playing it just like. You, yeah. Is this. Is this it? Yeah. Like when we finished it, it was like. And you gradually. But we knew there was a raid, but it's like, you know, we, we, we can't do it yet. And we don't know how yeah. to do it. And gradually your expectations are lowered. And the raid was fucked. Yeah. That raid yeah. was just fucked. Yeah. It's, it? it's still fucked. The first time we did it, yeah, there was an exotic chest right at the start or mm -hmm. whatever. And I dropped No Land Beyond the first time yeah, we did it. Yeah, you got an exotic. That's the away. only like positive memory I have from it. Yeah. And the raids I are guess, like the best thing, but mm -hmm. it's like only one that's <laughs> It's funny though, because like, like the raids were fucked, but that raid we established our own way. Like it became challenging. It was like, yeah. oh yeah, oh, I fucked up the cheese. Hang on guys, yeah. I have to wipe so I can <laughs> try the cheese again. <laughs> yeah. Hang on. Yeah. I'll just jump up in the air and arc blade over a fucking huge chasm that you're meant to not yeah. be able to do that with. Then they that's, also, that's a different point. They it seems weird the way they stagger matchmaking, where it's like, no, you can't matchmake raids. No. That's unreasonable. But like, the fucking division, you can matchmake, yeah. like, the really challenging mission mode. And it yeah. is, it is hard. And it yeah. does require cooperation. Even with, wa even with randoms. Even with randoms, <laughs> you can do it. I did it. The first time I did one was with, um, it was just two random, yeah. two random people. Or even, like, with the, it. when they introduced the Prison of Elders horde mode thing. I suppose uh, that's the thing, no. I'm, that's unfair. And the division, it is literally just shoot, get through. Yeah, yeah. With well, what about what about the mechanics, the um the prison of elders, which is the horde thing? You'd expect matchmaking for that. Yeah, but then I guess, maybe it's just the it's the it difficulty be... problem as well. Like like Skolas, which was the boss in the that in was the really hard. Thing. It was so difficult that yeah. I mean, we did it the other day and we fucking wrecked him. But it's because well, yeah, now it's all fucked and yeah. weird. And like they're they're rejigging this horde mode, mm -hmm. but so I, like an even harder mode. Yeah, to it's going to be gonna be, it's gonna be harder and require like more grinding and more boosting, mm -hmm. but it's not going to add they've any made, like they've new made content. the grind and the boost a little bit less shit because it's not like if I want to get to 320 on my helmet and I have a 305 helmet, I don't yeah. need to get like two to three 320 helmets now. I just need one, yeah, for example, because that's what it'll be. It just takes you up to that. Whereas before, like, it, it, can, it made you grind in that, like, once yeah. you got an item, you knew you needed like two more of that to be able to get. To fully yeah. level yours, so you'd have to keep playing. You'd have to keep doing it. And I have no problem with grinding. There's artificial in games. grind in, ga in games like that. It's fine. You expect it to a certain point. Yeah, it's when they like trivialize your time. Destiny does it. Halo Five does it with the rec packs. Mm -hmm. It's just like you need to reward me in some way, and there there is no reward like worthy for the amount of time you have to invest into some of these games at this point. Where it's just like. Well, you could always um, buy this microtransaction and speed mm -hmm. it up a little bit, but... And that's why yeah, I'm just like... Well, that's not up to you then, really. It's just pushing me away, mm -hmm. and I just don't care anymore. Like, it would take a lot, a real big thing. I, I, don't, I don't see myself ever playing the first Destiny ever again. Um, unless there was, like, some... I, no, well, there's like... nothing I can think of, because I know, I know what they're capable of releasing. Mm -hmm. And... None of it is just like worth my time. So like, they make all the old shit viable again and worthwhile. You still don't bother? No, because I've already played it all. Yeah. And what what would it be? Just a new level cap, mm -hmm. which will be completely made redundant by yeah. the sequel anyway. Whether it would just boost you to the next level. If you just look into the future, you just say yeah. Well, it's weird. Like, you say redundant, and then I'm thinking about it, and I think about other RPGs. Like, Skyrim's level cap was always eighty one. Yeah. But like well, Fallout doesn't have one, but obviously you run out of stuff to do. It's the point in Fallout. Like Yeah. You just you, you so you wait for content to come out so you actually have yeah. things to do to get XP. It's like a different style yeah. of game though. But like yeah, it's not like your gear becomes completely useless. No. Because gear doesn't have gear yeah. levels. It's games of gear levels where it gets fucked. Mm -hmm. It gets all weird. And the way they keep introducing currencies mm -hmm. as if they need more of those in Destiny. Yeah. The way old gear, well, you can never like, get attached to a piece of the gear. The sterling things, you can. I think the idea is you can buy them with with real money, Eververse money. Oh Jesus Christ! What, oh no, maybe, is maybe it is another fucking. Country. Yeah, I don't. It's so confusing. No, it has the Eververse logo on it. The Gecko was saying he, when he saw it, he, he he was like looking around and he saw the Eververse logo and it was like, yeah, fuck, yeah, <laughs> or whatever. So I I'd imagine it's like the you have to buy the tokens. Yeah. And it'll be like uneven, so you'd be encouraged to buy two instead of one, like the way, the way, the way Microsoft points worked. Yeah. For a game that's all, all about gear, though, mm -hmm. it seems weird that you can never I mean, actually knows? choose how you yeah, look. I mean, who knows? I'm Because I don't really, I don't watch their live streams, I read afterwards, and it's yeah. a little bit obtuse anyway. Mm -hmm. Who knows, maybe when it comes, it won't be so fucky, maybe it'll be actually be like, maybe the three ways of getting it each week. Yeah. Maybe that's enough. Yeah, maybe. But, 
But even then, you know, it's still like another currency, know. another mm. system. Well, and like, on principle, they yeah, you shouldn't be able to buy gear. No. Well, not gear that actually affects the game, like yeah. fucking Sparrow, whatever. They're on the line, like, testing to see what they can get away with, mm-hmm. I think. Because it's, it's just if a matter Destiny of time. Destiny 2 launches talk. with fucking microtransactions all over the place, that would be a real big, like, do I really want to play this game? Yeah. Do, do, you, do you think they're going to try and, like, build the game around around a type of wreck packy sort of no. system? No, I think they'll keep it the same RNGs shit that we've had. Yeah. Yeah. But then the, there is the the packs still are an RNG thing, aren't they? Yeah, but I think they'd be even worse. They want people to play thing. their game for as long as possible as well. Yeah, like if you give people access to microtransactions, look what Halo Five did. You just Halo Five is fucked though because it's like you can spend loads of money and get everything and then be like, I don't want to play the game, yeah. or you can barely earn anything. And yeah, like, I don't want to play the game. Yeah, there's no middle ground. Mm-hmm. I suppose Destiny like. I, I guess at first it was a bit shit, but then they yeah. kind of sorted it out. So because like my well, favorite, you, it's, the Destiny is manipulative. You get trapped in like a Stockholm mm-hmm. syndrome where you fucking hate it for not giving you anything. Yeah. And then when it does, you're like, "Thank you, Bungie, for they, giving me this thing that I." I'm kind pretty of sure wanted. they got like psychologists and like analysts to like work out what the exact amount of time yeah. someone gets yeah. fed up. There's like a, you get like a little boost of adrenaline or something. Yeah. In your body when it's like gambling. As well, yeah, it's the same. It's the equivalent yeah. of ga- it is gambling. Yeah, I, I get it. When I get like a good drop in that game, I'm like, right, I like this game again. I'm going to play it, and then I get yeah. a bad drop, and I'm like, oh, fuck it. I mean, I've yeah. lost the high. I lose the high mm-hmm. so quickly though now. Mm-hmm. Like, I spent money on Halo Five. Yeah, like we're not going to talk about that though. But, but then as soon as I had like shit, I was just like, oh, I don't want to play the game. Yeah, because the game doesn't doesn't interest me. I, I don't know. I can't. Yeah, can't put Destiny like it. kept me invested, mm-hmm. even when I. Even when I had stuff, I still yeah. wanted to keep playing to get more of the same stuff. Mm-hmm. I didn't care. I just wanted more. It's just one of those really easy to play games. Mm-hmm. And you, you play it with your buddies. Even if you, you have, have no fun focus time. or anything. Yeah. That has bugged me as well, eventually. Like, if you don't have a team, then yeah, the game's, no the game's pointless. The game. yeah. yeah, whenever anyone asks me about Destiny or The Division or there's another one that I can't think of, I just say, if you've got friends, you'll probably enjoy it mm-hmm. for a few like days. If you don't, have friends that want to play it, don't bother, don't get it. Yeah. You won't like There's it. No, you'll get nothing out of it. Mm-hmm. And that's what your fallouts are for and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. So take a lot for me to invest back into it. And yeah. uh, I mean, I, I know I'll probably keep playing it unless something else comes up in my existence. I enjoy doing more. Yeah. But at the moment, I, I guess don't we'll, have much. We'll report back yeah. after the April updates yeah. out to tell you how terrible it is. Yeah. I'll give, give us like a couple <laughs> of days to tell you whether it's. um. A fucking joke, or whether they do actually add some cool shit. Yeah, I'm, I'm, if I'm honest, I'm optimistic about the April update. Yeah, but I'm not sure if that's optimism because of how crap the game's been for so long. Because <laughs> I'm just like, this is a, this is a good, yeah, like, direction to take it in. Yes, sir. Because one thing, okay, this is like my last point. They have re whatevered old content. Mm-hmm. They have several months now, and let's say like a year maybe. I don't yeah. know when they're going to release Destiny 2. They could announce it in June, release it in November, mm-hmm. or whatever, or September. We'll hear it E3 or, either way. Yeah, or they'll announce June, release next spring or something. Mm-hmm. That'd oh, be, yeah, that's possible. Because that's the time when no one has anything to do anyway. Mm-hmm. So yeah, so it's either Christmas or when any, no one has anything to do. Yeah. I personally think they release it this year at the end of this year. Yeah, it's too, it's, yeah they can't. Yeah, it's been two years. The they need, that's been that's been two years, and they actually have managed to fit their thing. They said they, were they made do a ton that. of money off it as well. Oh, yeah. So, but yeah, I think in that time now though, they have months now to have that small team, then make Crota's End worthwhile again, mm-hmm. and also make um, the Go- Go- Vault of Glass worthwhile again. Yeah, and I think they will, and that'll take the light cap to like three six five again. Mm-hmm. That was the original light cap, wasn't it? It was three six five so, yeah. or something. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that was, yeah, that was the last one. Yeah, we'll go in full circle because that's they've added fifteen, add another fifteen, another. Do they, do they actually add? Because it's so fucking confusing. There's a level cap and a light. Yeah, once cap. you reach level forty, are they are they increasing that number? No, that's still forty. No. And now you can so go three three five for stuff you have to pay for, I guess. But then, like in Destiny two, yeah, they won't start at forty. It's they won't increase confusing. the XP level cap. They won't bother. Yeah, whatever. Do you think in Destiny though, um, if you're level forty in this one, you'll start at like level twenty or whatever or some shit, and level forty probably you have to do level forty again. Or they'll just break it down into some currency. You'll get some. You'll get like a booster of something at the yeah, start. Yeah, it'll be something like that. I expect. I don't know. Maybe it'll just be like a new set of guardians. They'll just set it in the future, so it's like your guardian's dead. Have a new <laughs> one. 
<laughs> no, they've already said that your 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 character's carrying over in some maybe, capacity. Maybe, maybe your characters will be your fucking vanguards <laughs> or some shit. Uh, yeah, yeah, they could pull that off. Because I've got one of each now. Yeah. And if you don't have one of each, it'll just be a stock one. It might do a Mass Effect in that weird way. <laughs> so you just carry over shit. I'll be if anything. For E3. Yeah. I am, this is E3. I am, I am quite interested in yeah. it. Because it's... See what kind of stuff's going to be. Kind of a weird one. Yeah. Because Xbox's big Quantum Break is coming out. And mm-hmm. now what have they got left? Gears of Gears. War. Halo Wars 2. This will be a slow year for Microsoft. Yeah. Anyway. Yeah. That was that one, everybody. Destiny. Destiny. Tell us what you think of Destiny. See, there's so much to say about this fucking game. That's I know. The, look how long this fucking video is. Yeah. They put, no one's probably made it this far. They've probably given up. One person has, and they said in the comments, I like cheese. Or they're like, you're wrong. <laughs> Fuck you. Yeah. Your opinion is wrong. <laughs> Fuck you for being analytical over a game you poured literal hundreds of hours into. Yeah. Fuck you. Boy.